Hey, this is Melanie with Hook to the Left, and today I'm gonna show you a haul that I got from Amazon. So let's go ahead and get started. Hi everybody, thanks so much for joining me today. So over the month of December, I got some gift certificates and some other stuff, so I actually ended up buying a lot of um, crochet stuff from Amazon, and I wanted to kind of pull it all together, show you what I got here in one video. So, um, without further ado, let me go ahead and show you everything. I will let you know everything that I'm going to show you at some point will probably be reviewed in the future on my channel, as well as I will have everything linked down below if you're interested. Okay, so let me uh, go ahead and just get right into it. So first things first, I got all, I'm telling you all, of the Clover Pom Pom Makers. So, I got your basic pack, which has your standard sizes in it. You know, your most common sizes, I think, is probably a better way to put it. But So, I got this one, which is your most common sizes of uh, pom-poms in here. So, you got your bigger one, and then you have some smaller ones here to do different things with. So, I did get that, and I happen to get one extra one that's going to be going to a friend of mine um, here in Canada here soon. But um, I need to get that in the mail. But yep, I got that. And then also, I got the super duper giant pom pom maker. This is to make some, it's got a picture of like making kind of topiaries, yarn topiaries and stuff like that. Um, but just a diff bunch of different things that you can make with this particular huge pom pom maker. I probably won't use this one as much. Um, but I do like large pom poms. I just don't know that something like this will go on a hat. You know? All right, and then, now these I probably will use. Oh, actually, I think it's a duplicate. This might end up being a giveaway. I didn't realize I had gotten these as a duplicate. Oh my gosh. So actually, I have, I have two duplicates. I didn't even know this, okay. So, I got this four pack, right? Thinking that this set of two is different from this four pack, but it's not. These are the same as what's in here. So I actually have a whole extra set. I think I'm gonna do that as a giveaway for the end of this video. So stay tuned for how you can enter for that. But yeah, so I've got a couple of extra pom-pom makers that are the same size as these right here. So um, I'm gonna set those aside. I didn't even realize that that was the same size. See, it goes to show how well I pay attention, right? Interesting, but these are the two and a half inch, three and three eighths inch, the um, one and three eighths inch, and the one and five eighths inch. And then this one is four and a half inches. What? And then I also got the super uber teeny tiny, and this will be so, so cute. Like if you put on the ends of stuff, the teeny tiny ones. What? Those are so tiny. So those sizes are three quarter and one inch pom pom makers. I mean, that doesn't take very much yarn to make those at all, but I can imagine those can be like edging. You can make them as like an edging. That would be super duper cute, especially on like a poncho or something. What? All right, so that's all the pom pom makers and I realized that I, I accidentally spent too much money on those because I got these and I didn't need to, or I got this set and I didn't need to get the, the, this set when I got these with those. Anyway, you live and you learn, right? Okay, so let me set these aside. Next up, I got, I did get a hook set um, and I'm anxious to test this out. So I don't know if you recognize this case at all, which I love the case and I love the color, right? Purple's amazing. All right. But this is a interchangeable light up crochet hook. So you have your handle here, it's an ergonomic handle, you can plug it into the computer and then you have your different hook sizes over here. So this is another one that I am going to test out. Yeah. I, have, I have some other light up hooks over there, uh, over there somewhere that I need to do a review on. Um, but now I also have these and that will be a great comparison between the two. The other set that I have is not like interchangeable hook heads. I like how compact this is. I will tell you from the start, that's one thing I do like about this. It's a compact, but they both have their own cases, which is always convenient. So 
that is another thing and of course like I said all this stuff is linked down below if you're interested in it you um, please go down below check it out I will be reviewing these at some point I just can't tell you exactly when um, because I do have some other reviews set up on my channel going and you know going forward let me get to the ho other hooks that I got and then we'll get to the books and the well there's one other thing before the books but first let's take it I got a couple of Ami hooks First, I thought they were Omni, O-M-N-I, but they're not. They're Omni or Omi. It's O-M-M-I hooks, crochet hooks. Um, they are in the pink and green box. So I got this one is a five and a half millimeter. Isn't that a pretty color? What? So I am actually using this for a project right now, so this will end up getting reviewed probably relatively soon for this one. And then I also got, and this one looks a lot like the Divot Shill Puck, except for I actually think the Divot Shill Puck is a little bit prettier because it's got more marbling in it. I also got this eight millimeter red hook right here. So this is the eight millimeter. Um, I ha I'm not testing this just yet. I'm sorry, this is not an eight millimeter. This is six and a half millimeter. So, which is, it is pretty, but I just, I think that the, um, the shilp with that has more marbling in it. And I really like that a lot better than I do, um, this, as far as the looks, I haven't tried this yet. I may feel good. So I got that hook now one more thing and then I'll show you the books that I got one of them actually I had to replace because it got ruined because it fell and the floor room was ruined by animals so this is the other thing I got this pretty early in the season so you may have seen this if you watch my lives or something but this is it's kind of like the idea of this is kind of like the yarn bowl so a yarn bowl you can put a ball or, or a cake of yarn into the yarn bowl and pull yarn out of it and keeps it from pop flopping around all over the place <coughs> This, as if for something that you're not getting a center pull on, so you're pulling from the outside, and then you, so you put it onto this, and then it spins around. See, this actually fully comes off here. It spins around. Um, so like that, that do I call it donut yarn. I don't know if any, what anybody else may call it, but that like the donut type of cakes, um, I think would work really well with this particular item. You know, um, as far as so it's not flopping around and you can easily um, crochet without without stops you know that's that that's the appeal of the center pole but anyway so I did get this and it's been stored back here with Lady Jane all right and finally to the books that I got I got a few crochet books okay. so this one um, I actually bought it for somebody else as a gift and I thought it would be really neat to have and I'm gonna I plan on doing a review on this one the, the binding got a little messed up, which I hate that, but so I do plan on doing a review on this one. It's called Granny Squares, and it's basically a ton of projects in here made from Granny Squares. So uh, that is that book. And then I rebought because it got ruined by the puppos. Gotta love those puppos. Oh, I'm losing, I'm losing pom pom makers. Um, I rebought this book, which is the Spectacular. You, you will probably not see a review on this one until we get closer to Halloween, but I did want to go ahead and replace that, so I did. And then final book and the final item that I got in this particular haul is a guide, a modern guide to texture to crochet. Do you recognize that hook? That is a Furl's Odyssey hook right there. Whew. You know you've been crocheting for some time whenever you can see a hook and, and know exactly what kind of hook it is. But so it's it's a textured crochet, so it's more of a stitch guide than it is a project. It has some projects in here, um, but it's more about the more uh, uh, textured, which I love textured uh, combinations, I guess so was stitch combinations. But um, so this is another one that I will review on my channel down the road. I just can't tell you when, but this will be sooner probably than the Halloween one because the Halloween one you're not going to see until next October. But um, yeah, so I got the textured crochet. So that is everything that I picked up through Amazon. I am so excited to try everything. So how can you win that this set? Let me show you. So how can you win this set 
of um, pom-pom makers <coughs> and this set has a set of four pom-pom makers and they're gonna be your average sizes the most common sizes that are used uh, when making pom-poms for hats and other projects um, so how can you win well go down below let me know what are you most interested in besides the pom-poms pom-pom makers at least these um, let me know what are you most interested in uh, seeing um, in my reviews from the Amazon stuff. What review would you like to see first? Go ahead and pop that in the answers tube down below and that will answer you to win these pom pom makers. Uh, I can't wait to see your answers. I can't wait to take out, check these things out and get you some reviews on my channel. Uh, I think these are pretty darn awesome items. Anyway, uh, thank you so much for joining me today. If you like all things crochet and yarn, then don't forget to go down below, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the bell so that you're reminded each time I come out with a brand new video. And tap the like button if you enjoyed this video. It really helps me out. It gets me in front of other people who are like-minded, and I really, really appreciate that. Without further ado, thank you all so much for being here today. I really appreciate each and every one of you. You guys have an amazing day. Bye-bye.